good afternoon everyone so i know it has been a long time since i have done a video like i've said before it's just a lot going on it is sunday it is 12 o'clock i would probably say this is my first day off in three months so i just want to run some errands um my mother-in-law is now here she does six months with my sister-in-law and then she does six months here she needs as y'all know we moved um bathroom right here um she needs a shower curtain and we forgot to get one so i'm going to do that i'm going to get some tea y'all know my obsession with the medicine ball and i think i'm going to come home and try to get or try to knock some videos out i actually have a lot of ideas especially topics about hair that i want to knock out today david is on the truck so i decided to get dressed up today um like i said i haven't and since i work from home I don't leave the house. I was thinking about it Friday night and I had to think about when's the last time I actually left the house. I think it's been about two weeks. So y'all know when I go out, I get dressed up anyway, but today is just really, I think I'll be running like two errands, but I dressed up anyway. So I decided to incorporate this video and I'm just gonna give you seven days of what I'm wearing. So today is going to be the first day and I'm just going to show you what I'm wearing from head to toe. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we're just gonna go from head to toe every single day. So starting with this right here, this is actually from David's Bridal. It was my wedding hair piece. And I loved it so much that I actually bought another one just in case I wanted to go longer or just in case I want a fuller look. Or just in case when I straighten my hair, y'all know I do it every year for my birthday. When my hair is straight, I can put one on both sides. Then we have my Dior Tribal Earring for an M for my birthday. I will be getting a T. And then on this side, I finally took my bandage off, so I will be getting my ear pierced. I am so excited. I cannot wait to actually wear two earrings. I would say it's probably been, gosh. It split very soon after we got married, which was in March. So. So excited about that and then i will back up so you can see the rest of what i am wearing okay so this dress is from ajay y'all have seen it before i absolutely love every single thing about that dress i don't subscribe to the notion that you cannot wear white after labor day wear what you want but y'all know that i love this dress it's my first time actually wearing it out of the house i have frolicked around in this dress in the house a couple of times this is my first time debuting her outside so this is the dress right here y'all know it has a little hole and then my bag this is not the shrimps bag it was sold out so i actually got this from amazon and then let me back up just a little bit my sandals that i was obsessed with from zara so that is the look for today and like i said i will be running errands um, yes, this is very over the top for errands, but y'all know I work six, seven days a week. So when I leave the house, I want to be cute and I want to be dressed, okay? Okay, so it is a Sunday. So we were just going to go from head to toe. So this is my head wrap. I got this from Amazon in a pack. This is my earring. It is from Dior. And I got my ear pierced yesterday. When I tell y'all I am so excited, I am so excited. So let me show you the rest of the outfit. Okay, so here is the rest of the outfit. This kimono robe is from Zara. I absolutely love this. And then this dress is from TJ Maxx. I don't have on any shoes because I did not leave the house today. Well, I'm lying. I went to Starbucks, um, but that was nothing special. But yes, this is the outfit for Sunday. All right, so it is about 5.30. Fall is definitely here. Time has definitely set back because as you can see, it is dark outside. So again, just starting from head to toe, y'all know that my hair is wrapped up. This is from Amazon. This is my D or travel earring for an M. For my birthday, I will be getting a T for Miss Turner. And then I will back up so you can see the rest of the outfit. Okay, so this is what I wore today, literally. And I love these baby doll dresses, especially on Mondays when I am super, super, super busy. This is from ASOS. It's just a very cute tie-dye-esque baby doll dress. I will link it if it's still available. I did not leave the house today, so I do have on furry socks. I got these from Amazon. I think I got them like a pack of six. So it had gray, white, and black. I will also link those. They are super warm and super comfortable. But this is what I wore today. And of course it features my obsession, voluminous sleeves. All right, so it is Tuesday. It is about 3.30. I'm on one of my 15 minute breaks. So again, just head to toe. So again, this came in a pack. It is a head wrap from Amazon. Then you can see that I have my dangly earrings. Yes, I have on one dangly earring. I'm trying to get back into the swing of things when it comes to wearing statement earrings. Because what I did not know, what the lady was telling me at the actual piercing place, 
if you're over the age of 10, don't go to Claire's. Okay, that's where I messed up the first time. So as you know, I got this one re-pierced. What she was telling me is to actually keep this post in two to three months, and then for you to actually start wearing like dangly earrings or like heavier statement earrings, it's actually going to take about a year for your piercing to um, heal, which I did not know. So I'm preparing myself, you know, on this side to wear earrings. So I'll probably just be wearing studs, but I'm in the house and I don't care. So if I wanna walk around the house in one statement earring I'm going to do that and then I will get up and show you what I'm wearing right here so you've seen this before if you have if you're a part of my community it is just a Zara little shirt dress little silky shirt dress and it's actually quite terrible with the Sun so let me all right so here it is just right here you have a tie it has slits on the side and that black thing you see is just something under it because it is a little see-through. And it's just something that I just kind of wear under a couple of my things because they're see-through. I'm in the house, so no socks. I'm wrapped up in my blanket. But yeah, this is the look for Tuesday. Love this. All right, it is Wednesday. It is about 11.30. So again, just head to toe, regular work day, taking calls, doing letters, making coverage decisions. So again, it's been a head wrap week. This is a wash week, so my hair has been in this, actually, my hair has been in the same twist since my dried twist. So I took those out, put some big ones in, and I just left it in a head wrap this, these past two weeks. So again, head wrap is from Amazon, it's in a pack. I will link it down below. These gorgeous earrings are from Banana Republic. And just like yesterday, yes, I'm wearing one dangly earring. So let's just go with the rest of the outfit. So you guys can actually see what I'm wearing because the light is glaring in that room. So we have this gorgeous cashmere sweater. It is from Nana. It does have like a little knot situation going on in the back. You can wear it off the shoulder or you can wear it like this. I prefer to wear it off the shoulder. You can either put it up like this or you can tuck it. We're in the house so it doesn't really matter. And then we do have this midi knit skirt from Express. And this is the look for today. Very casual and I actually really like this look. This is something that you could throw on with a top handle and some heels and you have an outfit. But yeah, this is it, easy casual. Wednesday. Okay, so it is Thursday. It is about, I think, like 10.30. Not a real busy day today. Just to switch things up a little bit. So here is my headscarf. It looks like it has birds on it, like tropical birds. And then here is my earring. I kind of wanted to pick up the green and blue in the headscarf. These are from J. Crew. And then y'all have seen my dress before. So I am finding that as far as working from home, I like to be cute, but I also like to be comfortable. And what I mean by that is nothing too constricting. So like knits and baby doll dresses. So let me go ahead and back up. All right, like I said, y'all have seen this dress a hundred times because y'all know I love it. And if Shona Joy ever makes another one, I am going to buy it in whatever color they have, except black. But this is the outfit for today. Cute and casual. And I believe, yes, this dress does have pockets. Y'all know it's a 10 in my book when the dress has pockets. But cute and casual, flowy. I can get up, I can move, I can move from one desk to another and handle what I need to handle. Okay, so it is Friday, it is about 3.30, so today is gonna kinda be like a two for one because I'm wearing something in the house to work and then later on, Aiden does have a football game, so I will be changing. So real quickly, again, we do have the head wrap. This is the same pack that I got with the tan one, it's from Amazon, and then you have my earring from J. Crew. Y'all know on this side, this is my newly pierced ear, so I cannot take this out for two to three months, and then I will back up to show you the rest of the outfit. Okay, so if you have been following me for a while, you have seen this outfit many many times it is from asos the duster is from asos it came in a set and so is the skirt it is a midi skirt or a maxi skirt on me these or this is from Target. if you have never bought one of their camis i would highly suggest you do the morona company they are so soft and i get tan black and white every season never fails they are so soft and they wear really well so this is the entire outfit no socks today because I've been cuddled up with my electric blanket. But this is the look today, very casual. And earlier or later on when I change, I will show y'all what I'm wearing to the football game. 
All right, so it is about 6.30. We are getting ready to head to Aiden's game. So I told you this would be kind of like a two for one. So again, we'll just start from the top. This is my head wrap from Amazon. Then I do have my earrings. These are from J. Crew, And then I will go over the rest of the outfit. All right, so starting at the top, I do have on a black turtleneck. And for this not to be a whole Morticia situation, I did choose a color uh, head wrap. So this is from Macy's, it's a turtleneck. And then I actually have on another layer. I hate being cold. This is from Cuddle Duds. And then I have on a black tube skirt. And I have on black boots. These are from DSW. These are my ride or die. I've had these, I would say, a good 10 years. And then I have on fleece leggings. And then I have on this gorgeous jacket from Off Sacks. It is real leather. And then on the inside, you can see if you can't, it's like really fluffy and furry. And then I also have a clear bag. So I live in South Carolina. I live in York County. So I don't know if you know, but it is a let's be clear state meaning that whatever you carry in the stadium has to be clear or it has to be a certain size. So it's currently, I think about 40 degrees. So we are definitely in fall season here in South Carolina. Although we have been having 60 days and then 75 days, it's going to be cold tonight. So this is what I'm wearing. And as far as my closet is concerned, this is about as football momish or casual as it's going to get. So I will see y'all tomorrow. All right, so good evening. It is Saturday, it is 5.30. I started work an hour early today, so my hours today were 7 to 5.30. I'm not gonna show you what I was wearing early because I literally worked in my robe today. But I do need to go to Target, so I decided just to get dressed up a little bit because I have noticed that since I work from home, I don't really leave the house. But when I do leave the house, I do wanna be cute, comfortable, chic, and classic. So this little number right here is from Zara. I will back up so you can see it. Now, it is officially fall in South Carolina. Typically when we start seeing days in the 50s and 60s, it's considered fall. And anything for me below 75, I'm cold. And I always save this set for anything I wanna say below like 65, 60, because if you wear this set anywhere from upwards of 60 to 65, really 60, you will be dying. I mean, this is, it's, it's beautifully made, but it's also a very heavy sweater material. So also you'll notice that my hair is down. I did take it out of the big twist. It is a wash weekend, but I'm just gonna be honest with you. It's not gonna happen today. It might happen tomorrow, which is Sunday. If it doesn't, I was, throw some water on it and I will put it right back up in a bun. Y'all do also know that um, one of my best girlfriends is getting married. She's getting married on November 18th. Y'all know that I typically straighten my hair for my hairversary, which is the day after my birthday, but I'm going to be doing it in this month of November instead of December. So that video will be coming. So again, just going from head to toe. Y'all know this is my pierced ear. And the reason why I'm going to Target is to actually get a stud to match. This side is Majuri. I did a little campaign with them and then I will back up. Okay, so like I said, this is a set. Very, very, very heavy set. I bought it because of the color. Y'all know I'm obsessed with Anima Iris. This is the first one, matte black, that I bought from her. I actually have another Brandon Blackwood coming out. It's the one that's brown with the fur. It's sold out. And then let me back up so y'all can see. Shoes are Dior, one of their classic pumps. And of course my obsession, the sleeves, but I love this. Most people think it is a dress, but it is a two piece. You can leave it out or you can tuck it in. And with this, I will not need a coat. As a matter of fact, if I was to put a coat on with this, just going in and out of the car, running errands, I would be hot. But if I was sitting outside, then I would more than likely bring a coat just to be sure, simply because right here is exposed. But yeah, this is the outfit for my one errand. And that's it. Okay, you guys, so that is it for this video. Let me know which outfit was your favorite throughout the week. I'm gonna say for me, it was this one, and then it was the head wrap with the Shona Joy baby dress or baby doll dress. But let me know if you like these videos just to kind of see what I'm wearing throughout the week. I just wanna remind you that here on YouTube, I do upload videos every Wednesday and Sunday. And then of course, you know right here, I'll put my Instagram handle. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, you guys. Bye.